All right, so this is our black security fencing panel uh, at 1.8 meters high. I'm going to show you how to install it today. All right, so before you start uh, putting in your security panel, you want to create a plan and uh, work out where your fence is going to go. So what we've done is we've put a peg at either end and we've worked out our string line where we want our fence to go. And our string line is nice and level and close to the ground as possible. Now I like to put my string line uh, to be, uh, the, uh, to be at the uh, bottom of the panel. That way you know, um, uh, you know if there's going to be any heights or gaps underneath uh, the panel. So then what you want to do is get yourself a, um, a spacer, which is the same length as your panel. And we've already put our first post in, and we've actually already got a hole dug ready to put the second post in. But basically when you're setting out the holes, you just want to put that um, spacer in, uh, in front of the post, in between the posts, and then you go along and you go, right, well this is the, where we need to mark uh, for our hole. So you either mark it somehow with a stick, um, or I like to use some paint. Um, and it's also a good idea to then, if you want to keep going along and marking along the length of your fence line, is just get a post cap, like so. Put that on the ground, on one side of your spacer, pick up your spacer, put that on the other side of the post, and then keep continuing along and marking out where you've got to dig your holes. That way you've got a pretty good chance that you're digging your holes in the right spot. All right, so we've set up that string line uh, to be level and uh, to mark the bottom of our fence panel. So what I like to do is then go ahead and mark then this post at 1800. So that way we know that every single post that we do is marked at 1800 and we, when we drop that into the concrete into the hole, uh, we know that that marks on the string line, therefore every single post is going to be um, exactly in line uh, along the top. Alright, so we've, got, we've actually already put in our first post and uh, we've dropped that down to that uh, mark that's on the post and level it all up uh, against the string line. Now what we want to do is uh, use our spacing. Now you want to put this in between the posts. Now this spacing that I've cut out is the exact same length as our panel, security panel that we're putting in. Um, so that's about 2.4 metres long. So then when we come to do our second panel, which also has a little mark on it, our second post, sorry, is that we can get it in we can hold that like a pendulum, let it find its level, and we slide that down into the concrete until we get uh, that bottom mark um, to the string line level. That way we know every single post is at the same uh, height. Um, and then you just go along and level that in. Now for the purpose of this video, we're just putting dirt around the post, but you must obviously put concrete around your post. All right, so what I like to do now is to put a bracket on this side of the post. Now what we need to do is to work out where the rail of your fence is gonna be. So what we need to do is measure down from the top of your picket, down to the top of the rail there, and it's about 150. So then you wanna come back here to your post, mark from the top of the post there, uh, down 150. Then what we want to do is to put our bracket in place onto that mark. All right. Then what we want, want to do is go along and put the rest of the brackets and just slide them on to the panel. Okay, so once you've, got the pan once you've got the panel in position, you want to slide the panel that, uh, the bracket that we've already screwed on here, you want to slide the top of that rail uh, into that. But then you've just loosely got the brackets just sitting at either end, they're ready to go. Now, this uh, black security panel is actually made out of steel, this one in particular. Um, it's quite heavy, so you might actually need, uh, it might be a two person job. To get this into position. So, but basically, we've got this all level and ready to go. 
this post here is a little high, but that's fine. Then you just want to go along and screw the rest of those panels in place, top and bottom. Uh, and then you, there you have it, that's pretty much it uh, of how to install a black 1.8 high security fence.